So, tell us your name. Hi, my name is Erica Gimple. And what's your idea for creating peace? How do we create peace? I think it's really a commitment. I think it's something that we have to consciously commit to. I think it, it starts personal and then it, it's a larger. And so I'll just describe uh, the thoughts I have about it. Um, Conflict is a natural part of life. I think when people have a conflict, it kind of just shows where, they, where they're ha wanting a different, mm, wanting something to be satisfied within themselves. So I think what is important is dialogue, first of all. So important to talk about what it is both people need so that they can get down to what they're trying to create and come together. And I think being able to find ways to verbally communicate, which is really clear and coming from an appreciation for, for each other rather than the differences. I think that's a big, a really big step in how we consciously relate to different people. Tico, I feel like this is hard. <laughs> like a moment of like, um, it's not hard. I'm just trying to, can we pause for one second? Just stop for a second. One is African American, my father's Slavic. I've always been about how do we bring different cultures together? How do we see the gifts we both bring rather than the differences solely? Because I think that's what happens when, when there's war or if you don't if, they, if you perceive somebody else as the other rather than no, they just have a different culture, they have a different gift that they're here to bring. But I think where where things where conflict comes up is where people aren't getting their needs met and I think it's so important to define what are the needs that each person is, is, is wanting to have fulfilled because once we can define those and find a way to create a solution that both people can feel satisfied then I think peace can be possible but I think it really starts with commitment.